Tory Lanez also put out new music. Put out that two pack of heat. Come on now, what else? He been dropping out music uh, since like the Fourth of July weekend. He been dropping out, You're right? Uh, dropping a song yeah. each week, mm-hmm. and I guess it's in preparation for like a full project. Mm-hmm. Um, and it sounds good. And I don't know what else to really say about the music. Like, just the music mis- sounds good. Oh, he did have an update in his case, too, right? Yeah, yeah. He had an update in his case, but yeah, yeah. the music also sounds really good yeah. for him to record that shit out of prison. At, behind how bars. How does that work? It's called Wish I Never uh, Met You and Cell 245. There we go. Yeah, I wish I knew how good they're getting this, Reggie. I have no idea. So he dropped um, a, a, a video over the weekend. I think it was a Friday, actually. Mm-hmm. Um, basically, he's saying that him and his manager... I've been trying to put music out and just trying to get the audio correct so that um, the fans still get the same. Our fans, our fans still get the same quality. So he said basically they figured it out and he's going to be dropping new music real soon or more and more frequently. Yeah, no, if it sound like that, the fans ain't going to be angry and mad. I ain't going to lie to you. That's that, that type of quality, nigga. It's niggas in the studio right now that didn't have that quality. So, yeah, there's been an update um, in his case. Mm-hmm. I, I don't know if y'all seen the details on it, but yes. it seemed like there was a very uh, pivotal piece to this puzzle that was missing at this time of the case kind of unfolding. And, yeah. yeah, I know you got the update. Oh, you know I got that. Me and Alex got it, right, Alex? Yeah, so nah, basi- I, I did my little yeah. deep dive on this as well. Hit it, P. So, basically, um, Tori's driver uh, slash best friend, he's calling himself, um, um, slash bodyguard. Slash bodyguard. <laughs> um, came out with an affidavit and basically came back and said, hey, like, basically he was the only one there that wasn't inebriated. And he gave his accounts as to what he saw transpired. Um, I felt like the affidavit um, kind of left, not left out, but left a few things not necessarily mentioned. I want to add to that. I, w- yeah. I want to highlight that that affidavit is from 2023. Yeah. And, and um, at the time... Uh, when he came to court, um, Tory's lawyer and the defense, uh, sorry, or and the um, what's the other shit? The uh, uh, prosecution. The prosecution mm-hmm. um, basically said he didn't. They didn't need him there because they were afraid. It came across like they were afraid that the case would uh, be more, even more so, prolonged into um, the holidays, which was the, um, Christmas, the Christmas, Christmas, season. Thanksgiving. Yeah. But for whatever reason, he came back now and he's saying, "Hey, like this is what I saw." Got it. Yeah. Well, we'll we'll continue to follow the case, see how things. Like he said, he's gonna be home soon, Tori. So, yeah. but niggas always say they coming home soon. That's I gotta chill, yo. I got an uncle right now doing thirty years, and, and he texts me over the weekend. What he say? I'm coming be home, home soon. soon Neff. No, you not. I said, wait, hold up. Like, I love you. You forgot what you did. <laughs> <laughs> you forgot I don't, the heinous crimes. But I get it though. Like you gotta tell yourself that. But and, don't and tell, tell me that. Lo- now you gotta tell your loved ones that because. And there you're thinking like, yo, yo, my loved ones need to feel like I'm okay. So let me just hit them with a lie. Yo, I'm going to be back soon. <laughs> I, I, got a, I got a question for Reggie. Mm-hmm. Reggie, how you feel about this? Well, I don't know because, well, the affidavit. Why are you guys laughing already? No, no, no it was because Pierre. It's the way he acts. <laughs> yeah. He was snickering and shit. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, this important update, this yeah. new evidence, it doesn't really matter because it was thrown out by the uh, attorney general. So it doesn't really matter anyway. Right. And it wasn't just because it was going to prolong the case and that's why they didn't call him before they the Tory's attorneys chose to not call the driver because they didn't they weren't sure of how he was going to testify so they chose to not ask the driver it wasn't some like oh my god well there there are two sides I'm open to hearing two sides of it but like Tory's team was like no we're not going to use the driver we don't need him now they want to say they need the driver so that's why the attorney general was like "Eh, it doesn't really help your case and it's, no, and it's like, also important to highlight that Tory Lanez got rid of the lawyers that got him prosecuted. For sure. So this is a whole new uh, batch of lawyers that he's dealing with here that are probably trying to do things retroactively. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, we'll keep y'all abreast and please keep yourself abreast. <laughs> okay? 